Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Taurus? This is Positive Thoughts of Energy. Welcome to my channel, Grand Rising. Good afternoon, good evening, good night. Whenever you come across this channel, I hope everyone is staying safe. How's all my beautiful subscribers, my new subscribers? Thank you so much for your beautiful energy, your likes, and sharing my content. It means a lot to me. I love you guys. Happy Monday. I hope everyone had a beautiful 4th of July weekend. I love you guys. Let's start out. New viewers, cross watchers, thank you for stopping by. Please take what resonate, resonate, leave the rest for someone else. Apply the gender roles and reverse the roles. How they fit in your life? Because you know why? I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know your life, so you're gonna have to reverse the roles. How they fit in your life? Okay, Taurus. All right, let's get started with affirmations okay Taurus you ready for me okay your first card is purpose Taurus your first card is purpose it says I wake each moment serving my life purpose and thinking of creative ways that I can take inspired actions towards my heart's desire a lot of you are really uh, you are really walking into your purpose okay you're really coming into uh, I think you had this card before gratitude you're walking in your purpose you know what your purpose is you're finally realizing why you are here also a lot of you are so grateful thankful and just so much gratitude I think I had this card I might have had this card again for you Taurus but I know one thing Dars, y'all are some very grateful human beings, okay? It says, I have the attitude of gratitude for the many gifts within my life, and I express my gratitude in many fascinating ways. I can say this, I can't say this enough, but Dars, y'all are very thankful, grateful signs, earth signs, okay? Uh, you always, you know, you are, you are so, you know, your purpose, your gratitude, uh, just y'all's energy is beautiful, so we're going to pull a vibration. <clears throat> Let's see where your vibration is at, okay? Taurus, all right. Spirit, guys, I've already pre-shuffled. Let's see. What is the vibration for Taurus? What is Taurus vibration? Spirit, guys, Taurus. <clears throat> What's Taurus? Okay, this one. All right. Your vibration, Taurus, is self-forgiveness. Okay, self-forgiveness. It says, when you keep repeating past events and past mistakes in your mind, you bring your energy down. Say to yourself, I forgive you. I did the best I could with the information I had at the time. At the time and then take a deep breath. <clears throat> oh, somebody needs to hear this. Somebody needs to hear this. You have been hard on yourself, Taurus. Some of you, someone has been hard on himself. And I, you ha just forgive. It says, say to yourself, I forgive you. I did the best I could with, with the information I had at the time. And then take a deep breath. Forgive yourself. I, I really feel like a lot of you still blame yourself for situation from past events, and it's not your fault. Okay, I want you to look in that mirror. I want you to tell yourself. I want you to put in a comment, I forgive you. You forgive yourself. OK, forgive yourself when you keep repeating your past events and past mistakes in your, ma in your mind, you bring your energy down. Forgive yourself, Taurus. It's time to forgive you because you're beating yourself up for the mistakes and the things that has happened in your past. And spirit is saying it's time for you to forgive you. Oh, I don't know who that's for, but that's for quite few of you. OK, that can be for any sign. But spirit wanted that out, Taurus. Mm, 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 mm. Beautiful spirit, guys. One more card for Taurus. One more card. One more vibration. Mm, okay. Let me get this together, y'all. That is beautiful. It's time to forgive yourself, Taurus. Thank you, spirit. Yeah. Your other, your next vibration is sleep. When you forgive yourself, take a good sleep. I'm gonna read this card. 
Think of sleep as a way to reset your energy and restore your body. Every day is a new energetic day. Ask yourself, Taurus, what if I sleep like a baby and I awoke refreshed? I feel like once a quite few of you be forgive yourself from things that you that have happened in your life that you cannot fix now, they are past. Once you forgive yourself, that's when you're going to sleep like a baby. You're going to wake up so refreshed because you have not forgiven yourself. Taurus. You have not forgiven yourself. You're blaming yourself for past mistakes and repeating. You know, you keep repeating past events and past mistakes in your mind. And it's time to let it go. Say to yourself, I forgive you. Whatever it is, forgive yourself. Okay? You did the best that you could. With the information and the time that you did have at that time, you did the best you could do. Now it's time to take a deep breath. Oh, my goodness. This is for somebody. Somebody needed this spirit, guys. It's time to take a deep breath and sleep and rest. You've been holding. You've been beating yourself up for too long. Too long, Taurus. Too long. It's time to forgive. It's time to forgive you, spirit guides. What's the energy? What's the energy? We did the vibration. Okay, thank you. Yeah, the world. Okay, I feel like sometimes when I intuitively see this card, you're very sad. It's like some of you feel like you're alone. Okay, you sometimes I feel like some of you are in a dark place. But let me tell you something. You're the, the light is about to come. Some of you have been sitting blaming yourself for stuff 10, 15, 20, 30, 40, 50 years ago, okay, that you don't walked away from. You're still blaming yourself. You're still, you're still putting it all in your head, repeating it all in your head. You sit and you and, you, and you're depressed about it, and you get sad. You be in a dark place sometimes. You've walked away from that. You did the best that you can do. You did all you can do at that time. You did the best that you can do with the information that you had at the time or whatever the situation. You did your best. Stop beating yourself up. Oh, my goodness. Spirit, guys. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, I feel a spirit right now. Somebody needed this. What is the animal card for Taurus? What's the animal card, spirit, guys? What's the animal card for Taurus? Okay, that one popped out. Okay. The elk. The elk is your card, Taurus. It says, I am strong. My inner core is powerful. I am physically fit, mentally focused, and emotionally balanced. Vital life force flows vigorously through me. Providing me with endurance. I live life with vein, vigor, and vitality. I enjoy passionate relationships that restore balance in my life. Taurus, you are the elk. At the back is the pre-sided jasper. It's the jasper. Y'all don't judge me. I, okay. It's the jasper. It says, how is your stamina? Do you feel healthy and strong? Do you let yourself relax and spend time with your family and group of friends? Take the time to renew yourself, Taurus, with the comfort of your favorite people. Spend some time with companion of the opposite gender to balance your energy. Exercise such as running or power walking will help you to increase the endurance at this time. I feel like a lot of you need to stop just beating yourself up. You need to let it go. You need to, you need to, you did all you can do when you did. Those two cards came out. Those are my, my manifest soul, soulmate oracle cards, but they're very powerful. Okay. The first card that came out is fall in love when you're ready, not when you're lonely. This is for somebody fall in love when you are ready, not when you are lonely. Okay, that's for somebody. 
Your second card is you want a person who comes into your life by accident but stays on purpose. Okay? That's what you want in your life. They stay they stay on purpose. And you have the purpose card right here, the gratitude card. But you got to stop blaming yourself from what you walked away from. You did all you can do, Taurus. You can't do anymore. Spirit guys, what is the message for Taurus? What is Taurus' message? What is it that Taurus needs to know? Well, we know, Taurus, you need to forgive yourself. You did what you can do at the time with the information that you had, okay? Spirit guys, what is the message for Taurus? What is the message? Oh, my goodness. Did y'all see that? Wow. OMG, I'm just going to go with what I got. Okay. All right. It's over. Let it go. <laughs> Divine is something. The spirit guides are something. Y'all see all those cars fell out? Mm-hmm. Just to get to this car, spirit say, let it go. That's You have transitioned. That was the old. You are the new. Let it go. It's over. Forgive yourself. Let it go. You are a different person from when you were then. Let it go. It's over. Taurus, it's over. Look at these little bit of cards, y'all. Half of the deck fell in the flow because spirit wants this out. It's over. It's done. Forgive yourself. You can't, you can't change. Okay? You can't change. Mm-hmm. You have the eight of pentacles. It's over. You have worked so hard, okay? You've worked so hard on what it is. I feel like a lot. That's my grandbaby, y'all. You hear her crying. You've worked so hard for, um, with what you have. You've worked so hard. You've transitioned. You know, you're not the same person. Forgive yourself. Yeah. It's time for a new beginning. That's the old, that's the old you. You have the world card, a new journey. Out with the old, in with the new. Look at here. It's over. Stop blaming yourself. You did what you can do with the information the best that you can do. Look at here. Look at here. You have an awakening. I told you you have trans you have transformed. It's over. Okay, you went through that dark night of the soul. You've went through the 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 karma, the karma and all that you had. You've done all that work. Look at you. Now you're about to be fruitfulness. The Ten of Pentacles. Fruitfulness. You're going to get some type of inheritance, some money, something owed to you, the abundance, because you did the work. And the, and the universe, the divine is rewarding you. You've did the work. Not only money owed to you, maybe alimony, child support, inheritance, windfall, but also a beautiful commitment. Something true, something real right here. Right here. Something true and real coming into your life. And this is longevity. Longevity. You deserve it. So stop. Let it go. You've done the work. You've did your karmic debt. You've worked. You've awakened. You've worked hard on yourself. Let it go. Spirit God said, let it go. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, let it go. A lot of you have a lot going for yourself. You could be counselors, preachers, priests, counselors, uh, motivational speakers. People look up to you. People look up to you. Tell me more, Spirit. Yeah, you are a manifester. You are a manifester. A beautiful soul. You are. Yeah, someone, someone's coming in. Someone's coming in. This longevity. Someone has a crush on you, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, Taurus. They're coming in. Someone sees you as a catch. This is who you want in your life. You want a person who comes into your life by accident but stays on purpose. Someone sees you. I told you this longevity, this beautiful commitment that's coming towards you. But you got to forgive yourself. 
Because that's how they see you. You are the queen of wands or the king of wands. Your very people look up to you, look at you sitting on your throne. You're, you're, you're glowing. You're a beautiful soul. But you got to stop in. You have to forgive yourself for something that you did the best that you could do. Okay? Get out of this stagnant energy. Get out of this stagnant energy. Yeah, this person's watching you. They're watching you, Taurus. This is a wish. You've been sitting waiting on this. The Nine of Cups, this is a wish granted. Mm -hmm. Get out of the sadness, looking back on memories, looking back on what happened, looking back on, you know, it. you know, you got to let it go. It's time to let it go, Taurus. It's time to let it go. Some of you have let it go. Some of you have cut it out. Okay? You let it go. You cut it out. You forgave yourself. You think about it a lot. But it's time for it so that you can get, get that out of your head. So that, yeah, you're thinking about it a lot. But you're ready. A lot of you ready to take a new leap of faith and go towards. Because you've been waiting on this beautiful soul, this beautiful person to come into your life. And they're coming. They're coming to us. You deserve it. You've done your work. You've done your work. You went through the dark night of soul. Okay? Just look in that mirror and say, I forgive you. Forgive yourself because you deserve all this beautifulness. All this beautifulness. Fall in love when you're ready, not when you're lonely. And you want to meet a person by accident, but stays on purpose. This person is coming into your life because you've done the work and because you have done so much and you're so grateful. And, and your gratitude, the divine universe, is rewarding you with this beautiful ten of pentacles. Not only ten of pentacles, but this beautiful commitment that's coming towards you. It's, all, it's done. Let it go. It's a new journey. A new journey. Let it go. Stop beating yourself up. You did the best that you could do with the information you had. And at the time, the situation, you did the best you could do. I want you to say to yourself, I forgive you. I'm Baza Thalsa Energy Taurus. Until next time.